I think it was the last thing that we did. It's been so long. Well, oh, it was the, it was the Galar uh, Neo Champions. Yeah, um, I legitimately thought the next time I'd be back would be for, like, summer, trying to get Marnie and Gloria and whoever the new characters are. Just because, uh, if you can't tell, I'm a little bit of a Marnie fan uh, by me constantly trying to pull every single variant of her. Uh, but that's neither here nor there. Um, and again, whoever else comes with her during the summer. But then they're like, hey, we know that Arceus has been out for like two years now. Let's ne just now finally release the Ar some Arceus characters. So we have Adam in here. And I'm like, okay. Looks pretty neat. Yeah, he has Leafeon. I saw a lot of people complaining that he has Leafeon. Um, and I'm like, I'm I'm kind of okay with it, just because I'm not the biggest fan of how Erica how Erica works anyways, because Erica is the other trainer who has uh, a Leafeon. Not the biggest fan of Erica. She does a lot of damage. But she needs Sunny Day up, and I don't like that. Now Adamant does need it at the beginning of a fight to activate one of his abilities, but he also activates from his passive automatically, so... Oh, I just thought, I haven't I haven't realized, uh... I mean, I haven't looked into what, uh... Arita does. But, dude, if she sets up set hail, immediately needs hail, like, Lucian, they actually made, like, type user. two to fair units who actually don't go together, that'd be so cringe. I didn't even think about that, because I'm like, yeah, he just sets it up automatically. So she probably sets up some kind of weather automatically, too. But anyways, he looks absolutely crazy. Like, he buffs up physical attack and physical defense by so freaking much. And he has a move uh, that you can use twice a battle. And all the condition is to use it is to attack once or use some kind of ability. And he hits basically as hard as a sync move, but with a high crit chance. And it hits everyone. So it's just like, wh wh what is this guy? I was like, I was looking at his details. Like, I was like... You know, I feel like they tend to, like, not go... For some reason, I feel like they don't go very hard for, like, the evolution characters. Like, I've never been... Like, I love the evolutions as, like, Pokemon. They never go hard in this game. Like, Misty with her Vaporeon is, like, whatever. Erica and her uh, Leafeon, again, can hit hard, but it was also, like, eh, who cares? Oh, we got... Oh, my gosh. This is such a short... I'm Adam and leader of the Diamond Clan, if you want to be formal. Uh, you know what? I mean, I'm down to get him there. I'm probably going to go to get the rest of the rewards and then probably cut it there. I was not expecting to get him so freaking fast. But again, I'll take that just because if they are starting to move into Arceus characters, then I need more diamonds. Along with also, again, Summer, whatever the, whoever the Summer characters are. I need diamonds for that. And Arita's still coming out, so I need diamonds for her. So I'm just going to get, like, the, the the special rewards and then go from there. But, uh, yeah. Like, other like other than that, like, there aren't really that many big evolution characters anyways. Like, I think there's a Faulkner with... Who has Jolteon? I forget who has Jolteon. But, uh... And Umbreon is just... Ugh, Umbreon's just a four-star character. Like, it's good. It's good. But I wish that somebody, like, a Master Fair had Umbreon because Umbreon's my favorite Pokemon. So I wish that somebody had that. But, yeah, no, I was just, like... Cause, so I was kind of expecting Adamant to be a little mid, because I'm like, oh, he's got a Leafeon. He's not going to be very good, is he? But then I kept reading his details, and I was like, he just... every Everything I read on him, he just gets better. Oh, like, what? He has, uh... His skill. Uh, what is it? What is it? It's this thing. Raises attack by six and defense by four, and reduces the own... The user... The sync move countdown by one when the sunny is weather... I mean, when the weather is sunny... And again, uh, he does it by himself. The only issue is, if he doesn't actually work with Arita, I don't know what kind of team I'll run him on. Because my, essentially, like I guess, like the best kind of Sinnoh, because he needs Sinnoh characters to be at max power. He doesn't. It doesn't look like he needs them to be good, just looking at his information. But to be at tippity-toppity shape, he needs more Sinnoh allies on the team. But my Sinnoh team is basically just... A triple Cynthia setup that sometimes switches out the Master Fair Cynthia with Garatina for somebody else if I need somebody else. Like, uh, for the, some of the, uh, Sinnoh events that came up. Oh my gosh, another one. Let's go. Where it's better to use Cyrus. I was like, all right, let's get Master Fair Cynthia out of here and put Cyrus on there. I'm not the biggest fan 
of the Master Fair, Cynthia. No She's another one of those, around. like, hits very hard units, but also just kind of dies immediately. I do like Shadow Force as an ability, though. I really do like the abilities that kind of, like, take someone away. Because, you know, you just set them up to be the target, and then you're safe for a while. I can't believe I just pulled another one of him. Okay, how many more of these do we have? Yeah, I, I was about to say, I think that this is the last one. Yeah, and then we'll call the video there. Freaking, dude, if I pull another... Imagine if I pull another one. Imagine if I pull it. Also, I'm sorry if you guys can hear stuff in the background. That's my fan. I got a new fan put into my computer just because I noticed it was overheating a little bit. But this new fan is loud. And I don't know how to get it to set at like a lower speed. I don't, I'm again, I'm terrible at computer stuff. Um, but I wanted, you know, it to be cooler and for me to be able to play. Because I was looking at my CPU usage when I was like, using my VTuber model and, like, games and all the other stuff. And I was like, it's only, like, it goes between, like, 40 to 60% depending on the game. So it shouldn't be, like, overheating at that point. But because of how bad the circulation is and there's only one... There's, like, well, it came with two. One on, like, the motherboard and one in, like, the back to, like, vent hot air out. Computer junk. But I'm like, it can... This computer can go between 200 RPM and 1800 and at, when it's going at full blast 1800, even if I'm running my VTuber model and a game and OBS, it's like at like 34 degrees, which is from what everything I could find pretty safe. Um, how many of these do I have? I just want to look while we're talking. A part of me does want to keep going just because he looks absurd, but I also, oh, can I not? I, I guess, I guess I can't. I guess I'm not allowed. That's okay, I guess. Um, but yeah, I just wanted to check, because if I could get another one of him, that would be pretty dope. But I do also want to say for Arita, because if she... Yeah, again, like... He can, like, decrease... He can power up physical moves up to 50% and reduce damage from physical moves by 31%. So if there's ever, like, an enemy who's weak to grass that also uses physical moves... Uh, yeah. Like, think all, all the rock types, basically. All the rock types, all the ground types. Like, if there's ever one where they're, like, set up to be weak to grass, the, he's absurd. Even without them, though, like, where he starts off with 20% uh, damage and 25% uh, damage reduction. Like, that's absurd. That's so good. Um, but, yeah. So, I do apologize if you can hear something in the background. It doesn't look like it's picking up on my mic, but I did want to say that just for uh, clarity's sake. Uh, so yeah, with that all being said, I'll see you guys in the next one. Bye-bye! <gasps>